as part of our work on the Social Inclusion Community Activation Programme in the Castlebar Claremorris lot, we decided to focus on Goal 2 case study, looking at new communities, specifically Ukrainians, displaced due to conflict. Hello, I'm Catherine McCluskey and I'm the Social Inclusion Coordinator for South West Mayo Development Company. In this current SICAP programme, we've done a lot of work with refugees, um, including Syrians. This new wave of displaced people, it has posed some challenges. In 2023, the number of Ukrainians throughout the Kassabar and Clemoris area, coupled with rural isolation and transport challenges, has moulded our strategic response to this vulnerable group. So I'm Bernie Rowland and I am the chairperson of the Loch Lana Voluntary Group. Our group, our voluntary group was established in 2020, in the summer of 2022 rather. And um, we, I suppose, came together, a, a number of us came together and we uh, communicated and uh, had discussions and conversations with the management here at Loch Lana Holiday Village uh, with regard to maybe providing extra uh, cultural and community activities for guests staying here here at Loch Lana. So we got in touch with Catherine, Catherine McCluskey from um, uh, SICAP and we were very fortunate to work very closely with Catherine uh, on this particular project on the Polytunnel. The role and contribution of SICAP for this Polytunnel Community Garden project is first and foremost partnerships. Without partnerships and collaboration, Long-term community projects like this one struggle to get going and stay going for the duration. This project shows an outcome in physical form, the growth in produce, but it also has lasting impacts in many ways for the participants. Ну, мне очень понравился вот этот проект с, с парником, теплицей, как называется правильно. Вот, потому что, значит, я на Украине, у меня такая была небольшая дача. Вот, и мы вместе с друзьями каждую субботу всегда выезжали на дачу. И даже там иногда зимой на праздники или еще когда -то. Вот, и мы вместе там работали, потом отдыхали. I'm Elmer Peterson and I'm the Healthy Mayo Coordinator with Mayo County Council. Healthy Island is a government-led initiative aimed at improving the health and well-being of people living in Ireland. One of the key aims of Healthy Island is to give every individual and every sector of society the opportunity to play their part in creating a healthy island. And key to that is working collaboratively with partner organisations. In this instance, South West Mayo Development Company SICAP and Loch Lana Community Volunteer Group. Ну и теперь, когда появилась таблица, то это мне напомнило Украину. Вот. И как бы вот э, я почувствовала, что тут действительно можно э, поработать тоже с, с э, хорошими людьми. Очень много вот наших украинцев приходило сюда и с удовольствием там делали, что-то старались. И вот это как бы все это немножко вдохновляло нас. И э, ну, мы чувствуем себя как бы немножко так ближе к дому. Да? И вообще очень еще хочу сказать, что мы очень благодарны вот, всем нашим сотрудникам, ну, нашим, вот, как сказать, не знаю, руководителям, которые здесь, администрации этого отеля, вот, потому что они нам создают такие условия, ну, как бы вот нам все очень нравится, они такие молодцы, они так стараются, они так заботятся про нас, поэтому мы очень и очень им за все благодарны и рады, что мы оказались именно здесь. Having something to look forward to on a regular basis, having a community of people who are going through the same challenges, having a space that is dedicated to you and your project, these are instrumental in ensuring positive feelings and outcomes from community work.
the help of the funding which we received from Healthy Ireland and through SICAP as well. It allowed us first of all to buy the tunnel and I suppose that's the first important thing. We wouldn't have been able to do that without that huge help and, and that it allowed us to buy materials as you can see here, materials for uh, the polytunnel, uh, um, plants, uh, uh, shrubs uh, and it also allowed us to buy tools and equipment that was necessary to set up this entire project. Um, it also allowed the, the guests here at Loch Lana Village um, the opportunity to work outdoors and that's very important I think it's very much part of their culture and what they have been used to in previous life so it allowed them to, to work here in the outdoors. They have you know integrated so well together they're very happy it has led to them becoming very happy. It is a social space for them and we intend to develop it more. We're going to get some seats for outside and it's, it's, the whole area has been developed more just as a meeting place for all those guys. It has been well proven that gardening and being in nature has a positive effect on a person both physically and emotionally. This has been the case on this project. Healthy Mayo through Mayo County Council and the Community Response Forum is delighted to be part of this programme and would like to take this opportunity to wish the programme and project the very best. We get great acknowledgement from our local businesses here in the town and locally uh, you know, on the, the work that's being done by the guests here at Loch Lana. Uh, Susie Fry, I have to men mention Susie because she has huge expertise in this area. Uh, she gave us invaluable uh, advice and uh, lent us a lot of her expertise as well in setting up this project. I'd just also like to thank Michael and the team at Organic Gardens in Ucklerard because they, they did help us. It was the first time they have done such a tunnel this size. And what they've done is put two of their tunnels together. And they, they came across in the time scale that we needed and they couldn't have been more helpful. I'd like to thank all that's been involved in this project to make it happen. All of the SICAP team, um, the Healthy Ireland funding, um, the management here in Loch Lana and the Loch Lana volunteers uh, group to help this come about, but most importantly the Ukrainian uh, people themselves for turning this into such a wonderful project for, for the whole community.